Our top story this morning, Austin police are on the scene of a SWAT call in northwest Austin. It's after a huge amount of fentanyl was found nearby. Fox 7 Austin's Kelly Sebera joins us live this morning from Blackfoot Trail. Kelly police just briefed us here about 30 minutes ago. What did they say? Yeah, Casey, and we just got new information within the last five minutes. We were told that this was a high risk search warrant, which is why it was a planned SWAT call. And just minutes ago, we found out that they found two suspects who had felony search warrants out against them and they were found unresponsive in the home. I'm going to step out of the shot so you can take a look at what's going on here. Now let's backtrack to yesterday when this all started. Early Thursday, detectives had a warrant on a storage facility nearby this home where they found the large amounts of drugs, as you said, Casey, including enough fentanyl to kill what they say is hundreds of thousands of people, as well as weapons and other drugs. Then a search warrant for this home was obtained. We're told that there are three suspects in total. One of them still hasn't been found. Again, this is a highly uh, a high risk situation here. According to APD's Dimitri Hobbs, they've been out here all morning. They used an explosion to open the door and then sent in APD's robot to roam the home. And that's how they eventually found the suspects. This is at Blackfoot and Sioux Trail. That's near McNeil Drive off of 183. This is in northwest Austin. They've been using the loudspeaker throughout the morning, the PA system that the SWAT team has to call the suspects by name to try to get them to surrender and that's when they eventually had to force their way inside to find these uh, suspects and again EMS has just came um, to the scene here like we said they are unresponsive it could be a possible overdose it's really unclear at this point we're told that one of the suspects is a female she's opened her eyes but they are transporting them to the hospital here again they both have felony warrants out for their arrest um, we are trying to gather more details this morning about how um, uh, how the uh, excuse me the suspects are doing what their situation is but of course we will update you both on air and online as those details become available sending it back to you